With the transfer window reaching its conclusion for this summer, we are yet to see anything related to the future of France international Samuel Umtiti. The centre-back arrived at Barcelona from Olympique Lyonnais a few years ago and became one of the best defenders in Europe during his time at Camp Nou. The crowning moment of the defender's career was when he played a crucial role in guiding France to their second World Cup triumph at the 2018 event in Russia. Since then, however, things have pretty much been downhill. Umtiti has struggled with form and mostly due to injuries. Barca are reportedly worried about the player's constant injury troubles that confined him to only 18 games for the club last season. Instead, it was Clément Longley who ended up playing around 40 games in all competitions for the Spaniards. Umtiti's contract with Barcelona expires in June 2023, but with the Euros coming up next year, the player should be looking to moving to a place where he'll have more game time. Reports claim that new manager Ronald Koeman doesn't see Umtiti as part of his plans. The defender isn't too keen on leaving Catalonia either, with his brother Yannick admitting that he might end up looking for a new club for his brother. Samuel does not want to leave Barca this summer, however, bearing in mind the club's desire for changes, alternatives may need to be studied, which suits the player's goals. The Lyon rumour is good, but unfortunately it's very unlikely to happen, Yannick told Foot01.com. While Umtiti does want to stay at the club he joined back in 2016, Barcelona are in dire need of some quick cash and also can't rely on a player who spent a good part of the last two years on the treatment table. Barcelona could do with some extra cash and Umtiti could do with a manager who believes in him and who would give him a fair amount of chances to return to his usual best. So let's have a look at some clubs that could suit Umtiti's needs and likewise. AS Roma Roma are pretty much covered in defence following the arrival of Marash Kumbula, but they're still keen on bringing back Chris Smalling. The England international spent last season on loan at the Capital Club and put in some fine displays. However, Man United are not looking to let go of their player for cheap, so Mtiti could be a great alternative despite the transfer fee needed. The Frenchman would further stabilise the Roma backline, but would this move actually happen? Well, on Football Manager it would. Everton Carlo Ancelotti is assembling quite a squad at Goodison Park. James Rodriguez arrived from Real Madrid, while Alain signed from Napoli. Both men have made an amazing start at their new club, while Yeri Mina is finally starting to showcase his true potential. One more defender and the Toffees could have one of the best backlines in England, but would Everton owner Fahad Moshiri sanction such a move? If Barcelona are willing to do business with Everton again, this is a deal that could happen, even though it would still be nothing less than a huge surprise. Olympique Lyonnais Samuel Umtiti is a graduate of Lyon's excellent academy that keeps producing some really amazing talent. A lot of players from France spend time at the training centre before earning moves to bigger sides. For Umtiti, perhaps it's time to make a brief return to where it all started for him. Things haven't gone his way at Barcelona in the last two years and maybe a return to his old stomping ground is exactly what the France international needs to get his career back on track. Stade René Playing in the Champions League for the first time in their history, the Breton club would do well to have some more experience in their ranks. Rugani is on the verge of signing for them, and the Italian would be a great option in defence. Now imagine if René were able to sign Umtiti as well. But hey, do we think this move is going to happen? Not in a million years. Paris Saint-Germain The Ligue 1 champions have the finances and the imagination to make big moves for big money. Following the departure of Thiago Silva to Chelsea, PSG do need someone who can pair up with Marquinhos, and Umtiti's experience of playing at the top level is something that makes him a great potential transfer target for Thomas Tuchel's side. The Frenchman will definitely add a lot of stability in the back line and will also be able to perfectly fill in the void created by Silva's departure. PSG haven't been very active in the transfer market this summer, but they might make their move if the stars align. Such a move, if it happens, wouldn't be surprising either. AC Milan while Stefano Pioli's men do have good options in defence, defensive depth is still an issue. The Italians have done well so far, but they might find it tough as the current season progresses. Having a player like Umtiti would help their cause for sure, since the Frenchman's experience and ability to link up well with the midfield makes him an asset for any club. Want to know how we never miss a match? With Fubo TV, you can stream any game, anytime, anywhere. Use our link in the description to start for free and watch your favourite teams live. Chelsea Frank Lampard has gone about quite a lavish spending spree this summer. The former England international has managed to bring in the likes of Kai Havertz, Timo Werner, Hakim Ziyech, Eduard Mendy, Thiago Silva and Malang Sarr to Stamford Bridge. 
However, the team's defensive issues are quite a lot in all honesty. The Blues don't have truly world-class options in their backline. Silva has lost his pace over the years. Andreas Christiansen is always prone to an error or two. Rudiger rarely gets a look in, while Fikayo Tomori is too young to be relied upon so heavily. Kurt Zuma seems to be the only defender who Lampard trusts at the moment, and the Frenchman does need a stable partner. Umtiti might have his injury worries to deal with, but when he's fit, he's one of the best defenders on the planet. Chelsea have spent a lot of money on attacking players this summer, but without a strong defence, Lampard cannot hope to compete with the likes of Liverpool and Man City. In the early stages of the new campaign, we've seen that Chelsea are quite susceptible to counter-attacks, which is down to the options they have in defence. Umtiti is a great organiser at the heat of defence, and he would definitely add a layer of solidity. Manchester United The Red Devils are clearly in dire need of defensive reinforcements. Harry Maguire is a solid defender, but he isn't the fastest centre-back on the planet. The Englishman can be easily beaten for pace, which is why he needs a solid partner in defence. Victor Lindelöf arrived at Old Trafford a few years ago from Benfica, and the Swede has proven to be an unreliable partner. Lindelöf is always susceptible to lapses in concentration and can be very half-hearted at times when it comes to intercepting players or simply putting his foot in. Eric Bailly can be a great defender on his day, but the Ivorian has his own injury worries. Bailly hasn't been able to feature for Man United as much as he would have liked, and that's only because he tends to get injured soon after returning from another injury. Smalling isn't needed, and Solskjaer plans to offload him, while Phil Jones is the forgotten man here. Marcos Rojo spent last season on loan in Argentina and is unlikely to be given a lot of chances. However, Axel Tuanzibi is one player who could be given a fair amount of chances this season once he's fully fit. The club's academy product did show a lot of promise when given the chance last season. But at this stage, United could really do with some more experience in the back line. Umtiti is definitely not going to come cheap, but the Frenchman does represent true value for money. If he manages to stay fully fit, Umtiti can be a really great presence at the heart of defence. Sadly though, the way Man United have been dealing in the transfer market is going to never let this move happen, even if Umtiti himself wanted to come to Old Trafford. The club's pursuit of Jadon Sancho has become rather embarrassing due to Ed Woodward's overall approach towards sealing deals. United are in a bad place right now, and even though having a player like Umtiti will help, this move is definitely not happening. As things stand, Umtiti's career at Barcelona is at a crossroads. The Frenchman is definitely a great defender. Sadly though, injury issues have really derailed his career. Barcelona are surely moving in a different direction, and it appears that Ronald Koeman does not see him as part of the club's immediate future. He might be a solid defender when fit, it's his injury issues that have hindered Umtiti in the last 24 months. Mundo Deportivo claims that Barcelona are eager to sell Umtiti even if the player's wish is to remain at Camp Nou. Barcelona are keen on bringing in a new defender and are even willing to loan Umtiti with an option to buy. However, is there any club out there that will be willing to take a gamble on a player who hasn't been able to perform at his best due to constant injury worries? Watch this space.